Welcome to the Q&A! How are we doing boys? Very good, very yeah. good. I have good, that is good. Uh, yeah, I swear. What year? What year? That's a cough, sweetie. Aye. Oh well. Addicted to them, by the way. Cough, sweeties? <laughs> You're addicted to them. I'm off to get an addiction. <laughs> to cough, sweeties? To cough, sweeties. I'm getting an addiction, but it's certainly not cough, sweeties. You're getting an addiction to spending <laughs> money these <laughs> days, aren't you? What about this guy? Let's go over there. Fucking boy racing, by the way. It's getting so quiet. Flew past me at 40 mile an hour in the motorway. Didn't you? Hit 40 mile an hour. 40 mile an hour, aye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm inside lane, man. I'm a kid. You be your partner. You're as bad as me. Oh, he's slaughtered me. <laughs> he's come in and. By the way, taking photos and everything. <laughs> 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 look, at, look at this prick. Yeah, I, mean, that, I, 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 the cup, mate. I come on. Up. I know you've got a new motor, but. I parked up in and straight. And he was doing taking photos and all that. And I think he was just I admiring bet. it. The the gap was incredible, so I thought... It was an incredible gap. I you just drove straight in. I went mean, then reverse back, so you get closer. And he ordered a taxi call. to get into the motor. Uh, uh, and, he's a miss miss it. and he's a private Reggie wanker. Uh, couldn't he miss it? Oh, he's slow. Who's got a private Reggie? <laughs> Reggie, a 75 or something? How can a 70 year old have a fucking yeah. private uh, Reggie? Have you, have you ever had one? I have, actually. Oh, there you I'm go. No, there. There I, was go. My, I was in my 20s, though. I you were 17, he just passed. What's the, what's, the, what's the thing behind the private Reggie? You won't recognise, then it? Oh. <laughs> right. That's exactly what he wants to recognise. Right. 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 As soon as you'll see your nose, they'll notice you anyway. Oh. Oh. Then you got private Reggie. Oh, do you think I'm Matt <laughs> Billy big time I want recognised? Right. Oh, 100%. 100%. <laughs> oh. By the way, and you'd fuck, you do get recognised, didn't you? You get recognised, mate. No, I fuck, I, because you're right. Close because there's nothing else, fuck's sake. <laughs> Oh, come on, he's a break man. I did play <laughs> once, once uh, a wee back in the days, but no, I'd run uh, no far from here. Uh, was it was full circle, a cake place. Carol wanted to go in. Friends went in. The guy was like, oh, we know and go. Uh, Fergus. Did he get a discount? You're up for fuck all. Do you know, no, my missus was getting, I didn't. I he didn't did, he took a discount. He's on it then. I was oh. out trying to find a parking meter. Couldn't he find one. Oh, I'm not shy, but. That street. Well, they you? offered me discount. Oh, and Shona, was that, it Shona? Yeah. Aye, fair, fair, definitely Fergus. Aye. Very nice. It was, it's nice. Cakes, no, you love it. He definitely did get a discount because they've said, if you mention this no, on no. the podcast, it'd be. <laughs> like, I'm I'm it's, sure it's, sure it's, it's not no, because I, I hate, I think it was card. <laughs> fuck card. I don't like card. So is that we pick card? Cash is king. Cash, cash is king. Cash is king. Card. And that thing you go on planes, it's got to be card. I get it. I prefer it, mate. All, pe all people like me need it. to pay cash. Why? Because because you've cheated the fucking system because you don't know how to cheat uh, I like to feel like cash. I just you know what you're spending as well. You go in a night out, you got your cash, ain't you? Then but you've got to be but careful. you lose cash you easy don't. deal. No, you don't. I do. I lose cash so easy. Where do you put your cash? That's where you uh, in her, under in, under in between her uh, uh, under, <laughs> under the soap drawer. That's where mine's is. No, if MD breaks into my house, it's under there. Nice and, wee under the soap drawer. Sticky soap. Looking in that drawer. Oh. Oh. The soap. So, <laughs> so, I'm crusting in between. I get to the money. The soaps are set. My hat got a fucking dare you, mate. Go. Go. Just have pop one it. fucking dip in. The puppet master. You'll, you'll, you'll lose your, your hand. Stuck in shape. Tony Hoos is. He's got a new house as well. Oh man. Who more? Nice. Yeah. Right, honestly, I got a phone call from my bank manager going, Oh, Mr. DL, I see you purchased a new house. I remember when you fuck all this is me. <laughs> <laughs> that was 10 minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> but so, every every room's got leather walls. Oh, <laughs> no, no one of the ones. I need to watch what I'm saying here and hope somebody doesn't watch us. But <laughs> it was one of the ones I wasn't really caring. I was at the Monorable Golf Day, right? I had nobody to talk to. Could you fucked off, right? <laughs> so I get a phone call. Like I heard you were up. playing. That's why I never went. I, oh, yeah. Yeah, I was terrible, and oh, I believe you. I ended up phoned, um, got the phone call. Listen, there's a wee chance of getting the house that you're looking for, whatever. So, uh, is it a house or a flat? It's a house. The house, good. Uh, castle. Um, and I ended up. I thought, right, I'm walking in. And I'm saying, look, I'm on the golf course. I says, D X Y and Z. Put that in. And then I played a hole and I played it badly, right? And I went, fuck that, I'm not paying that for a house. So I goes back on the phone, I says, no, I'm not, I'm not putting that offer in, put the other offer in. Mm -hmm. So I ended up, where's Friday when it's International Week for me? Where do I go? Friday. Sauna, sauna. Cla aye, after that, once, once I'm nice and relaxed. Why is it square? Wonder bar. <laughs> So, in your new motor, you don't you even drink, were you? Nah, Just nah, cruising nah. about the town. <laughs> By the way, she, she tried parking down that lane, I was reversing up my heart, right? <laughs> Fucking <laughs> nice, getting on the bounce, move it, move it. And they phoned me and they said, look, congratulations, you've 
you've got the house. Fucking sick, mate. Can I ask you a question, if you don't mind? How much over the home report value did you need to pay? Um, <laughs> I'm trying to work it out, right? But probably... I, uh, somebody was in for 20% over and I think I got it for 10 <coughs> You, somebody went twenty percent over, and oh. you got it for cheaper. Aye. Oh. Do you deal with because that? because they they're in a they were oh, in a chain they're, they're in a chain they're in a chain. So <clears throat> I'm not in a chain. I've nothing. You know Cash what I mean? I've Cash I'm, buyer. I'm, I'm under the show. That's where the show. <laughs> <I'm laughs> <under the show. laughs> <laughs> Fucking. <laughs> oh mate, see, do you know my couldn't even life deal? I have stamp never. duty. Oh, stamp I, duty, mate. You need to pay fucking. Listen, you're speaking to the right. I've not got a clue what you're talking about. Carol, there you go. Deal with it. Just, 153 just put me in the house. I don't know. I wouldn't have uh, 250. 250 is 5%, isn't it? Fucking it. I've not got a Scooby by the way. Where's that money going? <laughs> Think how many people buy <laughs> houses in this no. country's skin. Fix the roads, mate, that you don't like. And the roads are fucked. <laughs> <laughs> mate, <laughs> mate, it's a fucking scam. Stamp duty. What the fuck does that mean? What is I, didn't stamp duty? I, didn't, I don't even know what's going I didn't know you had to pay it either, right? <laughs> what? So, I oh. wasn't in talk. How was the same I didn't know. Right. You need to find another fucking six grand for something. <laughs> exactly. Lad, you man. I've fucking only got so many soaks, mate. Right? So, I, I, I didn't know either. I'm, I'm sitting there going, ah, stick that and stick that. And, and then when I got the call for the lawyers and all that and saying, right, okay, I says, How's the prices here? What do I pay? Lawyer? Lawyer's fees are fucking <laughs> through the roof. Oh, I'll just be saying You must know that with all your divorces. Oh, 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 well, well, they were ages. Do you know what lawyers do for that, mate? They get a piece of paper, they put their signature on it, send it back, and you get fucking fortunes for it. I wouldn't, I just, I just want to yeah, be yeah, out the uh, They're fucking <laughs> frauds, mate, lawyers. Honestly. I just move, I just fully what's happened and just I'm in <coughs> wherever I've been. Oh, but somebody needs to pay it, mate. Hey, yeah, Carol! Pay. Carol, <laughs> <laughs> she the bread one. <laughs> I'd no got a clue. I wouldn't even know what I've not You're honestly, better that way. Not you must scary. have paid him some amount of stamp duty in your <laughs> time, mate. You must have paid <laughs> him some amount of stamp duty. You pay it, didn't you? Do you get raging, though? You're paying through your lawyer, don't you? You pay it. You just need to pay it. It's no. Moan about all you want. You just need to pay it. Get a new a new build. They'll pay it for you. Did I? Sometimes, eh? Oh, they didn't. By the way, what a show, is well, it proper? Well, proper uh, uh, exactly. So oh, education, the uh, uh, incentives. <coughs> Fuck lawyers, well, yes, that's my take for today. Uh, right, right, I wanted to show you this because we need one after this today. I love to say. I wanted to sh uh, tell you this because remember we talked about proposals. Remember we talked about how you proposed to your missus, so a guy's wrote it as he's wrote, uh, watching the Coopman show, mate, and you talked about going down on one knee. I done it in my hole, but was in my boxers. Went down on one knee and had a hole in my boxers, and my balls were hanging out. She burst out laughing and said, "Yes, but your balls are." <laughs> that was sent in for a holiday. So thanks very much for that, pure jelly man. Amazing uh, that, isn't it? Really. But we need to mention SBK as ever. The Coopman Show is brought to you by our partners at SBK. This week, offer lads is a Scotland special with SBK providing a 25% bet builder boost. On this Saturday's massive game between Celtic and Aberdeen. What a game. Link to sign up to an account is in the description box below. TNCs do apply, 18 plus. Please gamble responsibly. Oh. Uh, right, well, we're going to go into domestic stuff, but I'm going to curveball you as I'm going to ask you about a couple of things that have came up this week, alright? So, first thing, Tuchel, England <coughs> appointing a German manager. What's your take on it? Peter going up for tits. I don't know. Yeah, the, but the whole thing, the whole process of says, Get the best guy for the job. Get winners to, to win. And then they get a guy that's won. Ah, and they go, oh, he's German. It's like, there's no, there's no great options. If they want an English manager, it was Potter or Howe. Maybe they spoke to both of them and they didn't want it. Mm. But, how but far the two of them have never won any in their careers. No, I know, but that's what they wanted. Uh -huh. <clears throat> um, he looks I'd, like I don't he know. likes to watch a bit of porn, doesn't he? <laughs> Mate, he actually, he's getting porn he's a right creep, now. He's getting porn right now. <laughs> By the way, I bet he, when he's watching the porn, he's getting the heart rate doing that. I can't get out of my heat, him preparing for a team. I've got him in the fucking recliner like that. He's got a like dodgy hair, do I know? Oh, his hair needs he's done. He's going to be the England manager. Drop it or get it, get it yeah. replaced. Yeah. Yeah. But he's one thing. Yeah. That's it. Simple as. The, what about this? They're obsessed with this. Is he going to sing the national anthem? Who gives a fuck? Well, Carsley, doesn't he? Didn't he know? Oh. Uh, so, I bet he came uh, in for a bit of stick for it. That's yeah, so what I'm saying, he, got, he got a bit of stick for that, mate. <coughs> does it really matter? Does it we better vote. Ah, we better vote. sang the Scottish National Did he fuck? I don't know. <laughs> I've not got a clue. Terry Butcher didn't they sing it? <laughs> when he was his coach for Scotland. Uh -huh. Who? Terry Butcher. Yeah. Sang what? Didn't they sing it? Chris Woods sang it. Uh, didn't they sing it? John Carver doesn't sing it. Like, what's the goalkeeping coach? Coach, I know that obviously being the head coach, but 
I, even I heard something today saying but, it sounds a wee bit like uh, it feels like it's a short term fix. They want to win. Well, no, exactly. Like, they've, they've had a manager that's built them for the last eight years and fell short, and all they, all they speak about is, I nah, didn't they win anything. You know, a, a, a better manager would have won something, but he built them into a, <clears throat> a team where the the media and the the players and and everybody's together because it used to be the. They were terrible, the, the media but, with the but England do, players. But did they no surprise you a man of his stature, right? Whether he say his record's magnificent. See, eighteen month contract. Right. Right, uh, I, I like that though. I, right. I like that about him. Fancy backs himself, didn't he? Right, but is that the no, is that a case of saying, Well, <clears> if a club job comes up, could you know managers yeah, maybe. Oh, maybe. maybe. Could be. The only other thing. eighteen month, mate. If, if if they're desperate to get him, you're sitting there with all the power, right? Because if the other ones have sort of knocked it back, the English ones, and he's your number one target. Well, well Carsley not... doesn't want it. Carsley could. No, hold he, on a bit. He's terrified. He's, he's terrified. No, no, he's terrified no, 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 no. Just throw them all into that. Was it a grease game? Mate, he lost the plot. He's maybe a great coach. Are you kidding? Can he say it? Hell, man. Can we not say bad about him? No. I thought he was a prick. I've got to him. He's going to say it. I'm a baseball bat that we should. No, you're right. He'd absolutely annihilate you. I know, but I'd have him a baseball bat. He's still bat. He's still bat. He's still bat. Against heat and stick in the soap drawer. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you get later. Oh, I can't wait to see you he won a, he, I won a couple of games and he was talking about getting the I vibes out that he wanted the job and blah blah blah. Doesn't then Greece spanked the arse after him, right? <coughs> and he's gone, right. no, my remit was the three camps. Then he beats Finland and he comes back out and goes, oh, it deserves a world class coach, but I'm no ruling myself out. Nah, he's Where never wanted it, does he? He's never, he's, he's no what the fuck know, but, and, you know, but, but you know what it's like when you what, get What did you think he set up with a, a, against Aye. Greece? Aye, I mean, I get you want to get your best players in, but you can't sometimes, no. you know, well, you can't accommodate the them off. It's clear to see. For a he was he's probably a nice ship. sweet guy, right? He's not he's a great guy. 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 He's a so he'd say, right, I like have a wee, a, wee, a wee ring in the, in the changing room. That's and class. He, you'd have the, he'd put the heat guard on and he wouldn't punch you. He's like, just try and hit me. So you're trying like fuck to hit him and he's blocking, parrying it, ducking out the way and just letting you unload for ages, right? Right. <laughs> no that unloading. And uh, <laughs> at the end, it, he just, you're trying to catch him like throwing hard uh -huh. punches and the end he just slips one stones, just pulls the like that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say to me? Why did you tell me this? I thought you should have been the manager. Imagine you came to your house the first day you made dinner just punched fuck at you. Amazing. And next thing, Man United's decision to stop paying Fergie. Oh, get come paid? on, seriously. He he didn't. Three million. He's been getting paid three million quid a year. I, I, stamp duty. Well, He's been I, getting stamp duty by Brooklyn Man United. That's where our money's gone. I've but still what about a room at Old Trafford? What like a bedroom? Private, private room. Like and what's it? Hospitality. Uh, How's he? Yeah, he still gets in. Check it out. I think he can do what he wants. I think so. And well, so he's built that club up to where it is. Because you know, some of the managers were saying they were feeling intimidated because he's there at the game. Yeah. Absolutely. But the thing is, so sad, didn't You can't handle that. The manager's peace. Uh, he that's was embarrassing. A, right, that's, that's embarrassing. where we go like that. Players, Stop, uh, get your fucking briefcase out. Right, you're out. Right, but it's one of them where, <laughs> right, so they go, right, ah, you need to lean on people for advice. So if you're going and asking right. them about how the club should be run, or if you're doing it, and you're asking them about the next manager, you need to pay him. Like, he's not got to date for nothing. I don't mind, guys. See, that's, that's even that. kind of guys that have been there and done it, been there and done it. I think it's a good thing that they're, they're kicking about the, the place. I 100% agree with kicking right. about, but I'm paying them three million. I didn't know about that, right? I'm right. But they weren't, they, they weren't, they weren't getting something for that. Uh, he's, he's a club ambassador, isn't he? So he goes to places like that. Clubs pay ambassadors. It's, so ambassadors it's just... get paid. Uh -huh. Aye. That's quite good. You it? need to get a sonar ambassador. Uh -huh. Jim, <laughs> exactly. But the Aitkins, the Aitkins are doing that. They're doing that. They're different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trips to Gervin, you'll get, it'll be brilliant. And oh, I, I want to pull you up on something. Right, Zip Z for Man United. Holy fuck. You didn't believe in he was a good. No wonder you just shouted his dad. Fuck me, man. Who? Big Zirk Z, man. Listen, but what I witnessed. For the two years that I watched him at Bologna, he needs to get back on the phone. It was different. It was yeah. different. Telling him what he did. I tell you, I said to you last week, uh, off, uh, off camera, he's a fucking monster, by the way. 
the size of him. You would mm. you look at him on the tail and you think, ah, oh, he's maybe six foot. He's about six foot for absolute bear. Is he? Really? Aye, but he's not. He, he was actually dead honest when he went to Man United. He says, I'm not an out and out goal scorer. There's a lot more in my game. He, I used to, he used to do my nut because he used to drift into the wide areas with Bologna because he likes to take part in the build up mm. and all that. But seeing you've got that size, physique, and the, the, the touch, well, stay, aye, yeah. stay running about the box, <coughs> but not, he, he likes to play. So a, sco- a striker that doesn't want to score goals in other teams. He, he says he's no one out and out, aye. He can hit the back, of course he can, but. Uh, but in you says what he's slow. He's like no. I'm together, telling it? you, it was surprising. You need to go and see him. <laughs> <Rang Butch. laughs> I'm telling you, he's he's. They're not exactly playing well, are they? No, I, I do right. feel from. But look, the what they pay for him? Uh, what? I think he's bothered anyway. He was at forty-three million. They paid for him. No, he's chilling. Calafiore as well. Yeah. They're away, so they're cruising. Uh, he's good, but I like so him at Arsenal. But again, he's a bit different. System, isn't he? He's different. Class. Last thing, lads, need to bring it up. Scotland twenty ones. And the route again, isn't it? Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan, mate. I feel first Come on, that you, you. Now, I'll stick Kazakhstan. Did it's, you a co- it's a coach. <laughs> what was Scotland first team? Where is Kazakhstan? So we're expecting far Scott away. came on like far, far far away. Away. <laughs> Scott came on right in the cup. <laughs> By the way, it's the first time they never game ever on the tail in the radio. Who's that? Gamer. I've Gamer. never heard. Right, so you've got to look at no, two passion. ways, old man. Is it is it for him? To educate them for a pathway into the, the, the international team, the top team, or is it you've got to both qualify? Both fans. Oh, Why should you not be able to do both of that group of players that he's got? I, I watched them against Belgium. It's sitting in a fucking five-three the, two. They beat Belgium mm. before. Sitting in a low block in their own half at Tynecastle. Guys like Lyle Cameron, Watson, the Lennon, the, Miller, Lennon Miller. They beat Belgium away. But, so uh, uh, I don't know. I, I think that normally when you're <coughs> early, early the years. It's maybe been groups where you're looking and saying, right, how many can get into the, the first team? And there have been a few that have stepped up. Mm-hmm. I think with this group of players, I you need both. You uh, need boys that are mentality ready to and up and their mentality. Games like that, when it, it matters, you need to get through. However you get through, that's the mentality. That's what you, the, the good pl- They're all good players. You've just rhymed them off and all that. Good players, but the mentality needs to switch. In terms that they believe that they, they shouldn't but even de- be in. But see, these play- bl- blaming the players' mentality, Dale, that's the last five tournaments. I cannot always well, just be I'll the tell same you what, group of players' uh, mentality. See, mentality and belief, <clears throat> it's a. Uh, but is that the coach? It's massive. There's a mentality well, and belief of the manager. They, they, aye, if you play under certain people you, you work under, then aye, that, that winners. And mentality is, is win, win at all costs at times. Sometimes it doesn't need to be sulky, it doesn't need to be fucking flamboyant. Just go and win, just win a game of football at all costs. Sometimes we think, maybe, I don't know, you shoot me down in flames, maybe without, it's about the progression, working on players and systems and all that. Fucking just go and win a game of football. That's what it's all about at the end of the day. This is a, but do you think the teams that win most to, are the teams that do This goes back to the youth system identity. as well, because all it is, it's about, oh, you played great, that was lovely, great to watch. Fucking win a game of football. I know, but do you think your the best day? chance of winning games of football is by dominating games and having a style and having an identity? I, of course, a bit of that, but sometimes you come up against somebody that maybe uh, might be better than you, might have a better system, might have a better mm. way of playing. You've got to find a way, and that's where that comes from, uh, that mentality. You've got to find a way. So you have, and that's what, something that I think that we, we miss out on. We don't, that's something that maybe we could tap into. That sort of, because I love guys, I love watching good football and all that, but I love teams that just win. Just win a game of football. Honestly. What's your, what do you, what do you I, say? Right, can I, and, and this is way off track. I watched a game at the weekend, right, junior game. It was Lark called Thistle uh, against Beath. Right, I went down to see it. Uh, Beath are what, two leagues above. Yeah. And I tell you what, it wasn't it pretty, but I tell you what, that Lark called Thistle side, they just dug in. Young guys, just worked, worked, get in about them and all that. And didn't allow them to play whatsoever. And won, they won it and uh, they went to penalty kicks. Right. And they won that. Mentality, you could see it in them. Mm. Just wanted to win. They won. However, and they get through, they're into the next run. So there's a lot to be said for that. Hmm? Better than their league. In the league, in the in a one-off game, league, league two. <coughs> aye, league two. I think they're up top. Aye. Right. Aye. So the manager's obviously doing something right. Aye. It's hard. It's I it. think you talk about <coughs> styles and our, our national system isn't they controlled as much. Like the development of players isn't they controlled as much by the the SFA and their directive. A lot of national teams, it's about the national team. That's you know they're in charge. What well, in terms they, of this is how we must play. Aye, so I'm, I'm sure in Germany it's it's central to the, the the German FA, the English FA. Years ago, obviously they've got the finances. <coughs> St George's Park, we're, we're going to produce number tens. That was a directive. 
and now they've got them coming at coming at their ears. They don't know, you know, how to play them because yeah. they've produced all these these players yeah. that play a certain way. But why don't you do that? Because we, the, I don't think they have this much control. I think the the academies are separate. Each individual club decides how they want to play, play. and d- develop their players. And but that's obviously not working. But why don't we change it? Well, d- no working in terms of what producing players. Tournaments. Pr- but <coughs> Like, would you change great, the system you go and qualify around. for a tournament but I would rather see young players playing in first team teams uh, and, and being uh, ready to go and uh, I wouldn't mind, enough I, wouldn't mind. Well, I think uh, the, the last couple of years it's getting better I, I would rather see a young boy come in and bypass the 21s because he's good enough for the first team, the first team yeah, yeah. so uh, uh, look, it's hard uh, obviously you want you want to qualify does because we never qualified mean that we're not producing players? I don't think so. I think we've got a lot of good young players, and, and then playing in that game doesn't mean they're bad players. Um, but I think it's tough to have a. They try to do it with the the schools and you know the the Project Brave stuff, and you know trying to get young players playing mere, mere football. But ultimately, I, I think that's this. I think they are, <coughs> but they can do that, and they can be coached a certain way at school. They go into their academy system and get coached a different way. There's no, there's no one, you know, path of the players. This is how we want to play. We've got a, a game model. They call it. They don't have it. We don't have it, and it's hard to implement it because each of each individual. Look, you look at, in the, just in the top fight, the different styles of play, and I don't think that's a bad thing because I think players need to learn. Look, like Derek said, to dig in, yeah. to find a win. I all right, you want. To, you have to right. technically be very good mm-hmm. at the modern game. You have to physically be very good, but you need to understand different ways of playing as well. But if you look at like, when was the last player Rangers produced, Hearts produced, Hibs produced? What for their team? Team. That came well, through. did McCausland <coughs> come through there? Might not. Uh, well, well, brought him in at sixteen. Brought, brought him in early. Aye. Uh, but so you're right. There's no. Uh, listen, the days gone by when. It was the first team and we used to sit and wait for an opportunity, young players mm. to get in and get into the first team, somebody get injured, suspended and all that. Different now because you look at most of these teams, it's foreign guys that are coming in, big money, it's all about <laughs> the wages, it's all about... So it's, uh, there's a there's a fine pathway now, I think, for young kids to come through. And I think you've got to be exceptional. You've got to deserve to be in there first and foremost, but I think you've got to be exceptional. I know, but Daz, I thought I thought there was more money going into first teams back in the day with Fadi, even guys like say like when I was there, like John Kennedy, Steve, all them coming. They're coming through. Uh, they're coming through with better players in the first team. Do you think there was more money? You you think there was more money? Yeah, Celtic are paying for Then what Celtic are paying in it? Sutton, Larson, and all that, hundred percent. Mm-hmm. They, oh, they boys were getting I'm through. No, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It's certainly before I came into the the Motherwell first team, I there was a lot of money being spent. But the reason I got in was I, I played a couple of games as, as a sub in that. But Motherwell. The reason I got in Motherwell in the administration, so there was a lot of young players that got a chance to play. But even look at Charlie Adam, and Chris Burke at Rangers, like the guys that they were coming in playing in, in front of better players than what are at Rangers now, nah. They were loaned out. Charlie was loaned out, mm. wasn't he? He was out at St. Man. Alan and Hutton coming team, in at Rangers. Team football. Yeah, but, but they need to be playing first team football. There's a, there's a lot of a overcoaching age. for me for Aye. young players these days. Overcoaching. You, the best and, way and you're not allowed to, to be individual, and I don't mean do what they want, but they, they're not allowed to make the own decisions. It, 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 it's a big problem because you get to a first team level where the manager and your coach is telling you for six, seven, eight year old all the way through exactly what to do, and if you don't do it, you're you're no playing. Then you get into a level where you've you've got your instruction, but you're expected to have. You know, take some responsibility. You can't do it because mm. you've never been allowed to do it. You've always been told, pass it, pass it here. He'll move there. When he goes there, you get to him, and you move here. And it's all, so it's all too structured. Best coach young boys are not allowed to go and boys. make go their own mistakes. Go and play with experienced boys, and mm. it's not even them coaching you and telling you. It's you being clever enough to, to watch, watch them, them. Yeah. and pick up things for them and see <clears> how it's done and how to win games of football. No fucking rocket science, is it, man? Well, Under I mean, 16s finished bottom, and they're. Uh, is it the, uh, the, what is it the thingy shield victory shield finish bottom England won it in the, t- in the tournament Scotland never won a game is that so s- in, that in, in, school uh, boy yeah. that uh, I mean I played school boys and all that the, the 15s and all that the but that's the other thing I know they done away with schools football as well didn't they uh, a lot of that so, you, this is another thing we were getting into it like, I like it but it's still I, the same you, it's still the same players <coughs> for academies that they're 
they're picking yeah. that academies don't allow their players, some of them, to play school football. And it's the same problem. They're, everything today is structured in a way that they can't they can learn. Do you think themselves. that's wrong then? I do. Mm -hmm. I, I, I do. I, I agree. I think there's too many... I've watched loads of sessions where it's stop, start, and if you're, you're, before a boy's controlled it, never mind his they're, body position, never mind how he receives it, it's pass it. He's not even got it yet. Can so so the, so the heat's done... Play a pass. Oh, what are you doing that for? And the boys know. What if that boys say, like you? What if that boys like oh. you that just wants to go and get it? People, I, I, they, they don't to encourage that. Huh? What's to say? But you have got to then sometimes be as a young. And this is where the old kind of gallusness, old glazy thing kicks in. You need to be able to say sometimes, like, okay, okay, I'm taking it in, I'm taking one board. But fucking once the game starts, I'm going to fuck. I know I can. That's funny because we were talking to somebody yesterday. Well, David, I'm it's going got to, to come out later. And it's been in football. And he actually was talking about developing young players and he worked with Faddy. Yeah. And he was always talking about he would never have restricted Faddy. I don't know if he can remember that. <coughs> yeah, yeah. To, to touch. To touch, uh -huh. But there's other players where he would. Other players where he would. He says, so you have to get that balance. Mm -hmm. There's no mm -hmm. point saying to him, take two touch up and that's it. Because that's not his game. His game was all about going at people and fucking mm -hmm. and, and greedy. And our game would be uh, isolate him 1v1. Mm -hmm. So my job is... It might be two touches of control to get, it, to get it in and let him get go somebody get so he, he can go and create it. I mean, it's not. No. Bro, that's what I'm it's, saying, it's no rockets. Again, I'm not wanting people like, <coughs> to lose their job or that, but why, no, again, why are we a nation that somebody stays in a job that's not qualified for the last five? Why, 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 why are we not changing? If someone's not working, why do we not change it? You after a job? No, I, do, I thought I wouldn't mm. take that, mate. <laughs> they wouldn't take me either, but. Uh, you would take that job, not? <laughs> no, I wouldn't take that. Why? Like, I like. Want to try to win three points on a Saturday, mate? What, what have you got in your B license? Yeah, uh, allows you to manage, right? doesn't it? And it's still, does that still allow? You know, do another one? No, I'm not doing another one, mate. No, no. 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 Surely, if you want to go down that path of coaching, you've got to progress all the time. We've do all you, got uh, to do it. So, uh, how do you think then one of the badges progresses? I don't. I'm, I'm not great because you need to do need it. That, to uh, you need uh, that. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm like you. I'm not. I'm not a great lover. You know, I go. Do you know how much? It's a few bob as oh, well. Oh, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. fortune. Aye, which, which, which yeah. rules? Which is a problem with me because it rules other people out of then that guys that you see that are good coaches, good communicators, good way the kids and the youth. But then they go like ah, that, well, if I get 15 grand, I don't know what it is, to pick. they've no go at it. Mm. So you're just going like that, discarding it, which is, which is wrong. Right, Scotland, review these <coughs> two games for us, Fadi, you were over in Croatia, we'll start with you. Uh, what did you make of that performance result and also the Portugal performance and result? Croatia, I thought, good, good performance. Um, it's obviously disappointing to, to lose the game. Uh, but I, I thought that watching the game and being there, I don't know what it looked like on on the telly well it wasn't on the telly but on YouTube YouTube, um, YouTube uh, fucking <laughs> it doesn't <laughs> even seem, seem like real football <laughs> <laughs> it? But so, it doesn't even no, no, well, right, so the, be, the best thing about that you, you watched it at night they build hear, up there's no nah, nothing do you hear Big Charlie's oh commentary mate. I'll do try to start a motorbike <laughs> oh mate what about when I, I, Rob Rob Stiton, he went, he's just been screwed into the ground and then all of a sudden there was a wee silence and you go Somebody will need to go on and screw it. See, see me going up, but see the build up and then half time, it doesn't feel real. Aye. See, next time, I'm not even going to watch it again. I would, I would, listen, I would rather hang out to be fucking in Scotland. I'd bet for Gillette popped up 30 minutes into the game. <laughs> because people, fucking skip. <laughs> see, people are Gillette, in. Gillette, aye, so much. <laughs> <laughs> see, when people are in, when they see when he's beard. It, see, look, when there's build up and there's talking where it's uh, Faddy and Boyd or whatever, <laughs> games and all that. So it's it, and you know it's coming, but when it's just blank, it's you. Do you know the worst garbage. thing about it is? We were watching it on our big it's telly, right? So see when you type in you, and I was thinking, oh no, it's going to jump up you, someone else. <laughs> so I've you. never typed in T so quick in my life, mate, because they were all sitting in the living room, and I put in you, and I was I, like, oh. Just as I just realised someone else could put, I just pressed it so quick and just came up YouTube. I don't know, something. What are you doing, man? No, it's just because it was through my phone. Connect my phone to it. Sorry, Faddy, but anyway, sorry, Gary, on you go. Exactly, YouTube. Aye, well, we do, but the Croatia game, I thought we looked really good. They're a team that have obviously played, I know it was a wee while ago, World Cup final, got far in the Euros, final in Nations League. So they're a good side, but I felt as though. We looked as on a par with them. I didn't think it was like the Portugal game. Obviously, you need to defend and you need to, you know, dig in at times. 
I didn't feel like that was the case with, with Croatia. I thought they they were good, but I didn't mm. think it was like, oh, these are amazing. They're miles better than us. So I thought I thought they I thought they played well. Um, I thought Dalt looked good. I know people were saying, some people were saying he was amazing. Some people were saying, don't get carried away. I thought he looked good because he made good decisions during the game, like when he comes show up, taking it inside, mixing his game up. The cross for the goal, it's not a great cross, but he went down the line just before it. Mm. Then he cu cuts inside, so the variations there. The final ball will come. I just thought he looked. He and he's really playing good. as a good player. Yeah, he's playing against Fadio. the second, second, <coughs> the most expensive defender ever. Yeah, plays for Man City, top player, and he looked, he looked really good. Yeah. And I, I know that people are saying, "Oh, don't get carried away." He's only eighteen, but how often do you see, you know, the the players they bring them in and say, "Rapid, he's rapid," particularly when they're young, and you that's go, "He's got." That's all they've got. Mm -hmm. They've no got the touch or the awareness or the the the, the look. He, he looks like he knows what he wants to do. The final ball that will come so I was excited with him and I thought players that have maybe come in for a bit of stick I thought Ralston looked very good uh, he did in the two games certainly looks more confident Suter outstanding in, in yeah. both games and it was these are areas where getting into the game people are saying well you're missing key players Hickey Hickey's a big miss but it looks like he's going about for the most of this season as well so somebody's going to have to play right back Ralston's come in Suter came in and, and done really well and I thought Andy Robertson has been brilliant. He's he's a top player, but I think he's been he's been excellent really in the in the shift to the back four. Um, so I thought it was quite positive. I, I, I day I think it was positive. Back you look at the players. Ah, it is for me. Yeah, Craig Gordon. I would I would <coughs> this. I think Craig Gordon would have played even if Angus Gunn was fit. And I think that no Craig Gordon's number one. There's been this call me, for like a change in style with Steve Clark. Have you seen that? Well, he changed the, the formation at the back, didn't he? But the big question mark is, he changed it because Tierney's not there. Right. Because the three and the two, the wing backs were all designed on Tierney and Robertson getting your best players in. So does he go? And I, I agree with you. I thought, especially second half, only seen the second half of Portugal. I was travelling back, but I thought Suter was. Aye. Nah. Outstanding. Mm -hmm. Everything that came in that box, he, he attacked. Another time, Ken, Ken, Ken McLean that came in, done really well. Yeah. Ken McLean's a top. I know, player. but it's it's one where you're looking, ah. saying right. But he gets a lot Everybody says we're no, yeah. we're not our strongest, which we are not. But these players have come in and, and done well. So yeah. now that it shows that there are options there when everybody comes Clark back. I wasn't surprised that I was going to ask. Clark you. made a bloomer in the summer in the Euros. The keeper should have been there, and Suter should have been there. Who was? And I tell you what. Fair play to they two, by the way. What a fucking attitude they yeah, two have got. Mm. They, listen, you bet. Well, they were gutted, absolutely. Aye. Be spewing. But they've come back in and, and Suter's been excellent. Last game I saw him with Rangers and uh, it was against St. Johnson. They left him 1v1 a lot of times with that boy, Sabidi. Uh, and he is he can shift. By the way, he can motor yeah. Suter back. I think he's back. been better since Goldson's left, Suter. Aye. He's been on the right hand side. I just think he's injury free. And I think he's always, mm -hmm. there's always been a good player well, there. Definitely. And that's the important thing. He's getting a run of games now. He's in beside proper there. So that, that'll help you to a certain extent. But I've always liked Suter. It's just been injury free. He's fit as a fiddle at the minute. And he's just shown yeah. his quality. Were you surprised that Dyke started ahead of Adams, given how Adams he has started the uh, series? <laughs> yeah, I think he was ill and didn't train as much. Right. So. Um, but I, I know people look and I, I get it. He's a striker that does, he's not even playing that often for Birmingham that doesn't score goals. When you're watching a game, and this goes on to probably the shooter point as well. At times when you, we took the ball <coughs> against Croatia, especially, and then Croatia put the press on, Suter will play the forward pass. He'll look for the striker, and I think Dykes holds yeah. it up better mm. to take the pressure off because if you're trying to play out and it's you. you you're running into yeah. a, a, a bit of trouble. Once it comes back up to the striker, then the midfielders can go and move. I think Dykes holds it up better, or wins fills, or gets in the in the right positions. Look, we want strikers to score goals, but it's no blessings. has got a, a better balance now than <clears> when he, at times when he breaks into right. the middle of the part and plays a pass. He's no doing it all the time. He's picking and choosing his moments, so he's a bit more savvy about him. You know, well, what would be your two if you're going to go to, going to go to centre backs? Everyone's fit. Who would your two be? Well, like, like, you like Han is it Hanley? Like, aye, but I, I, I think you've got to get Tierney in the team. I think, I think. See, does that not go back to the <coughs> like England we're talking about? England, they're trying to accommodate all their. I know, and I know, Sometimes I, th I think they look better with a back four. Who? Who's Scott? I'm a four. 
Oh, that's, right. right. play that's, that's when I would play Tierney. I would play Shooter or Tierney. I think it, no. might, would de- you, aye? it might depend on the game long. for me. Depend oh. on the game. I yeah. think when you look at <coughs> the games against Portugal, you need to defend a lot of cross balls. You need. He's no. That's but not at his game. But see, also what, what, what you're talking about there, and you're getting sort of the praise for coming forward, mm-hmm. and I think that's important. Aye. Tierney can do it all day long, yeah. and he loves doing it. So I think you've got to have that balance as well. Mm-hmm. I like the fact Tierney's left footer, top players, two Aye. can play in the right. I know what you're saying. Maybe that wee bit physicality with balls coming in against you know uh, strong centre forward. But I just think you, I, if I was a manager of Scotland and I had everybody fit. I would have Tierney and Robertson right. on my team. Yeah. I don't think we're good enough to go, well, you can't put all... You, you're talking about England. England, they just threw it. That's what I mean. But they've got, but they've got abundance of quality. <laughs> yeah. We don't have that abundance of quality. Mm. I think it's it's hard because the, the tournament that we've played in have been disappointing. But mostly because Tierney's not been there. Mm. He's no... So the system's built for, for him mm. and Robertson to fit them in. And we've qualified comfortably to get there and playing that way. Yeah. So, uh, and people, if it goes back to it, straight away people go and say, "How oh, are you then going back to that? We've been we've been playing well, but mm. it worked before. Well, yeah, it just yeah. doesn't work as well when he's when not he's the team. Not there. Uh, uh, if you want to be so a team that is going to play it for the back, then Tierney and Tutor would be a yeah. perfect combination, <clears> wouldn't they? Both yeah. them can I, play. I think yeah. before took the, at times the Portuguese games are a wee bit different, but at times they took the ball, and it wasn't a panic. Like there wasn't a forward pass on, so it went out and it came back in and went out again. And they played under a wee bit of a pressure in the Croatia game, particularly the, the, the Portugal game is a wee bit different. But they still took the ball. They still showed that you know they're they're willing to take risks. And like McTominay's chance early in the game, he's got to yeah, score it. Score, uh, That's an unbelievable uh, chance for him. Yeah. So with chances to go and take the lead and then defend and frustrate them. They're all, all the Portugal players are moaning. I mean. I ideally, I you'd want to go talk to talk with them, but we just can't. You're asking. There was one change for, for Saturday for the Croatia game. You're asking the same players to go again. It's it's tough, mm. especially with the amount of work they have to put in. I told you, Ronaldo is the biggest arsehole on the planet. You, there you go. I'm labelling him as the biggest arsehole. Oh, what is up with that guy? He's a surprise. Look, there's no surprise. The young team at Figi just Park, and he's trying to say, "I'm sure I've done him in." <laughs> Tell you, man. He, yeah, yeah, like there, Mate, imagine playing with that guy. Ah, I, I tell you, but every time I, I wasn't, I'd put people in so, and again, the YouTube factor and all that. Every time I lifted my head up, what did tell you? He was Great. either heeding my an hour or missing it, and then I spit the dummy. It was that nah, game. It, mind, what was the game at the Euros it, where he just hit a, a, a shot for everywhere? everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> it was like that. <laughs> like, I just <laughs> need to score here. Like, he des- I, for me, I don't deserves it. Right. Right. He deserves it. He's done, right. mate. And, you know, he's aye. fucking done. When you he's look what? at the, he's you look done the chances, ah, my boy. You look at the chances. He's yeah, fucking how many goals you scored last year? See if that had felt she Adams. Right. What is it? There's three. I can think of three. Why not? That he should do at least. Can Tony that, Adams would have scored it? Aye, aye. I thought he was poor. Uh, Are you sitting here fucking? Uh, I know, I know. Best players I know. in the world. Aye, because it's I about the here and the now. I know it's about here and the now. And look, if you look on chances that he had, He's came he was to the poor. Point where if he scores, he's brought great. Aye. And aye. if he doesn't, then you're looking at it for the team point of view, saying. You know, you need you'd love to be quite easy, easy just oh, to make it. Love it. Is, but you'd love to be in the dish. He'd cut his clothes constantly. His clothes would be getting really hot. shoes to the fucking way. Deep heat in the boxers. Deep heat in the boxers, man. Yeah, we're going to up for that. And by the way, the thing is, we Martinez will play him until he's about 70, mate. Oh, he'll play great. There's no way Martinez is dropping him. Would you? Because he'll just do that to him, wouldn't he? Put me back in the team. He's done already. He's done on the bench a couple of times, hasn't he? Amazing. Right, domestic stuff, lads. Hearts have appointed a new manager. Uh, Neil Critchley, a lot of fans saying it's quite an underwhelming appointment. You agree with that? Hundred percent. I I, I, I I didn't see it coming, but obviously they've been doing a process that they think that analytics yeah. or whatever. I, 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 but again, you why are you going to slaughter this when I'm it's going been, to when it's been right, successful in right? previous clubs? Why no, are you going to slaughter? No, that? I'm not going to slaughter. I just think sometimes we get too carried away uh, with us. Now I look at that guy and I look at his CV, and it doesn't. Really Strike me as I'd go along with that. He's going to be fucking. He's got to take hearts to the next <laughs> level. I, I I totally understand all the the procedures there, but sometimes you've got to look at the bigger picture, right? Okay, and <clears throat> are the are the better option with the better options out there for hearts? Who would have been a better option for you? I don't know. Well, you, Derek. It's 
listen, there's no doubt he's a good coach. Yeah. Right, we can I get that. Yeah. But I, I agree with, with Daz. I know he's going to go the other no, way. I, but management-wise, I mean, he's had two spells yeah. at Blackpool. QPR uh, didn't they? Do? Managing, I told he obviously he's been there and done it. It's a totally different thing for coaching. You know, so they need a good, experienced manager in there. Because I went down that route with A. Smith, the younger <coughs> player. Who else was it before? Uh, there was a computer Cathro. boy. Cathro the computer well. boy. The computer. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he loved it. The game was on YouTube, oh, didn't he? He was oh, like, oh, "This is fucking brilliant, man." Oh, I've seen, seen him. I've seen him staining his trousers. <laughs> <laughs> I'll <laughs> never forget that game. Staining his trousers. He stained his trousers. He's well now. The manager. He stained. Right. I don't think he is. I've seen someone last week. He's on the press. Who's that? Who's that? Oh, he's stained his trousers. He made a fortune. He came in. Everybody spoke how this guy has got to fucking change the world of football. Well, right, oh, reinvent the wheel, and they're playing Rangers and Ranger, and he's just became the manager, and he turns up with us, we V neck on a fucking shirt and tie, right? He'd have just slapped him right around the head. And so you wanted shirt and tie? I I know, no, that, no, 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 V neck, mate. No, V neck. Who's got a black hoodie on? I'm not stunned. I'm not. He saw a lighter trousers on, and you could honestly, you could see the. Colour changing his <laughs> art, right? Because he didn't, and, and that, he had no clue what to do. I've seen them all, right? I've seen Austin McVie turn up at Ibrox like mm -hmm. he was the best man at fucking his mate's wedding, right? The, oh, the, what, the three piece suit, the fucking yeah, I I I was was right? <laughs> McVie, you're talking that, about yeah, so. people talk about, I think, the roles in football, Aye, right? that's and but, you're right. You look at Michael Beale, right? He couldn't manage nothing, mm -hmm. he couldn't. Uh, everybody says he was a great coach. But you're right, man it's management. People, isn't it? And yeah. Fadil, he's been in the coaching side there. Now. See, when you look at, you've got to deal with guys that are coming in and forget the training ground, right? You've got guys coming in there with personal problems. You've got guys coming in with different That's problems. The, you've got people that you've got to recognise mm -hmm. in the morning. By the way, there's something he's done, he's no at it. Mm -hmm. Then you've got to be a strong character Definitely. in the dressing room and go toe-to-toe -to -toe with people that you're thinking, well, hold on a minute, this is a big character in this mm -hmm. dressing room. I can't back down. Coaching. That's managing. Aye, there's coaching managing and people. Managing. And then leave the coaching to the coaches. You delegate the same as to the coaches. You can't put him in with I, 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 I'm not team. saying... He has managed. But he has managed. He has managed. Aye, no, no, very no. well. No, but he's had no, he a success of Blackpool. This is why the heart supporters will be kind of... Going, what the fuck? I think they will because they'll look at that. I like, think people are getting carried away with so they think that but hopefully they think they've just put all the stuff into a computer and they've popped up with this name right. and it's just right, we'll let the computer pick. You still had to interview. Yeah. So the, the and the the whole uh, says no putting the <coughs> the whole <coughs> criticism <coughs> of the, the computer, computer says, says no. no. <laughs> 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 well, why is that all again? I did it. I well, well, the computer well, says no. You got to. You might look yourself. You might look yourself. I think you've got to. Hold that one. And you've got to give him that opportunity. Right, let's hear his take on it. So the 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 amount of stick that they've got for using data without probably looking as much into it as they should. The data is no going to say just throw names in there and come out. There's a there's a process. You look at Brighton. Who are heavily involved in the, the process? They've not made many mistakes. Bad, players, I managers. The, when they brought the when they brought Potter in for the championship, oh, if, who'd then you know obviously been in Sweden before and, and took Ostersons all the way through the leagues. It's it's because their data su suggesting this guy could work at that level. It doesn't mean that it's going to be a hit. Mm. Deserbi come in. Loads of people. Would you know about the Premier League? Nothing. Brilliant. Hitzler, who's in the new, 31 year old, why are you bringing him in? Alright, look, the, the jury's still out on it. All their players, it's through their, their data system. Do you know what the system shows, Faddy? What is it that, what, what it is was, it that comes out? Is it like XG? No, I, I, I think it's, stuff? so they'll put in whatever their, whatever their programme is, it'll put in the level they've worked at, the level that they're looking for them to work at, so Scottish Premier, Premiership, can they work at that level? Um, the type, the type of games that, f for players wise, the the type of games they're playing in, are they playing against the, the the team that's top of the league? Are they playing against the team when they're when they're putting their data in for the players? And it's it's not it's to find people that we we wouldn't look at. 
I mean, wouldn't they think, oh, that's he's a stick on that player's this? They done it with uh, the, the the second team union, uh, Sanji was in, in Belgium. Mm-hmm. Took them up, got them into Europe, found players that people maybe wouldn't have looked at and says these these are the players for me. So I, I understand straight away you'd look and say you can't let a computer pick. There's a background to that. Yeah. The, 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 the Brighton can back it up because the success yeah. that they've had. Look at where they are now as a club. They sell players. They've sold players, but two players for over a hundred million. Oh, yeah, yeah, Casido, yeah, yeah. Brought Casido in for five, sold it for a hundred. But there's always some, that. there's always something you can have an argument and go, well, Brighton will back up. But then you can have an argument against other teams that, if it was that easy, yeah. every team in the world would be shutting down, right? Get computer, computer but no, no. Uh-huh. right? Get that, but no. right? But but, but Brighton but, found the formula, right? But but everybody else can find the formula. But it doesn't mean to say it's every time because Brighton's. It's what for Brighton. It's going to work for every single. No, other. I know that. Uh, but you know it's straight I mean? away, people are looking, going, "I ah, just throw a name in a computer. For what you got to come up with? It's not. I know. I know. There's happening. a lot more. Well, it might, about it might fail. And, and, it might fail. Every, I, I think it's a wee bit unfair to, you know, judge a guy till Aye. at the end of the day, he's went up there and you're right to say interviewed well, gave him an opportunity. You know what I mean? We're all good ah, because yeah. we don't really know him, and he's <clears> not really had a big career or whatever. He's getting into a big club, right? Fine, no problem. I'm prepared right. to sit back and say, right, but I don't buy into because Brighton's so successful doing it this way. If that's the case, every team in the world's going to do it that way because you go, oh well, Brighton's so successful. There's going to be times where it won't work, Aye, of course, and a lot yeah. of times this it is, won't work. <clears throat> diff- Hearts are a big club. The pressure is on right away. So you look where he, he's managed Blackpool, QPR, maybe I. I mean, he's got a decent sized club. Aye, yeah. but Hearts is a different. He's got a good, st- he's got a good st- style of play. He wants to play. That. I, I like the way he speaks about how aye. he's going to play. Aye, right, but 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 that fucking if win that's, games a fun. See that? See that's the way he's going to play. Before you get your style aye. of play, just but, go and win. Get well, he's got Sid, he's got St. Mirren, then he's got Hibs. Aye, which is tough. Which could get him, after, get him after a Hibs. good start. Yeah. <coughs> but he could have a Hibs great... Hibs a couple of weeks, that a couple of weeks, aye. Oh, aye. He could yeah. have a great style of play, right? <coughs> so, this is the way I'm going to play. This is formation. This is style I'm going to play. He's walking into a club that he never seen one player. Mm. He he's got, got, good, good got players that can play that he's style of football. He might do players. players that can play that style of football. I think the thing is, we need to... Too often we get put guys coming into Scottish football and straight away we all go, nah, but why is he get that job? And they're not getting a chance. Hearts are not exactly. No, we're going to give him a chance. It's no, just know, the questions. But that, that, that's what's come up because that's the question that's been asked. Could you? Because I was like, ah, yeah. who's that? And then you start delving into his background and all that. And what with Daz is saying, you were talking about computers. I'm just thinking, you sit round, you get about six, five or six names there that you would like at a club. A bit of experience for me. Then. You tap into guys that have been there, done it, you speak to them, you go through it, the process, you make contact and then you kind of whittle it down and then you try and interview the two or three, if you can, mm. and then you get them in. But uh, So it's all new to me, yeah. all this stuff. What I'll say with this is, if it doesn't work, mm. it, then the criticism of the data stuff, because what do you do? Yeah. Just go and do no, the, same, the same thing and come back with somebody. Mm. Yeah. Do you know, so mm-hmm. it, it's it's a big... Computer says what? Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> it's, a, it's a big... It, it's a big ga- no big gamble. It's it's one where Different, it's, 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 it's you maybe we're oh, yeah. yeah. we need to we need to welcome it mm. yeah, and hope that oh well everybody else apart from you know outside hearts we wouldn't be hoping it goes well but I think for just something a, a different approach yeah get a chance but two t- there you go you've just rhymed a few games two tough games uh, win them don't worry about and the performances have been a wee bit better. Under, under Liam Fox, aye. I think he's done well aye. when he aye. came in. I think he's going to keep him on the staff as well. He said, "Could I seen that?" Was he? We should. Uh-huh. Uh, right, <coughs> uh, game of the weekend. Celtic v Aberdeen. Wolf. Both looking to protect their hundred percent staff. Wolf. Can Aberdeen shock? What are you one? saying, Wolf? Wolf. 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 I could have been, that is a crack, isn't it? Put that in the analytical, uh, analytical computer. Where's the computer soon? Three nothing. Aye. Are you Celtic? Aye. Oh, fuck! I thought you were going to go that way. Right, so answer my question. <laughs> Can Aberdeen surprise everyone? No. Can they? Aye, they've been brilliant up to now, can. aren't they? But I don't see it. I, well, well, I think Celtic will win, but personal, can, Aberdeen can win the game, of course they can. Mm. Is it a good st- time to get Celtic on the back in international as well? Or does that really matter? I don't know if it is a good mm. time to play nah. Celtic then. At home, um, Celtic at home. But no, like, Rod- Rodgers has not had the full week the, to prepare the, the for Ross Aberdeen. The game as well, they've, they've, they've performed that way. I just think at Aye. home, Paul Hoos, big game. 
I think we'll put more often than not they turn up Celtic. Uh, didn't they? We'd expect. And I just Celtic fancy them, but I think and Aberdeen I, can win the game. Aye. They, I, I'm not Seriously. so sure. I, I think, think they can. I think that'll be that a rub of the green. But one uh, one. Aberdeen. No, I think Ab- Celtic will win. There you go. Then. But I think they can. They could shock. Do you think it'll be close? Do I'm not, I don't know. I don't know. See, I don't. I don't I, I've got a funny feeling it might not. It could either. No, I. I Do you know what I love strongly. though? That's that we're we've talking about it like that. Exactly. Which is I love the fact that you're saying. Oh Aberdeen, you know, could they? Mm, ah, they? They probably could. I don't think they will, but you just you just don't know. So, and this is a manager nobody knew about before they came in. So. Hold on, hold on. So when would Rodgers Dan Aberdeen <laughs> win <laughs> the <laughs> game? Well, you know that the guy that owns Brighton's a is a gam- professional gambler, yeah. so he knows about algorithms and all that. Yeah. Uh, what do you think, Aberdeen? Off of them what chances you give them? Well, I, I think people say right. Can Aberdeen? You know, can this be the year Aberdeen are going to be up there challenging? Over? Next four games Celtic, Dundee United, Rangers, and Celtic in the semi final. <clears throat> That's got to be, yeah. after that, you'll probably look at Aberdeen and say, oof, they can be right up there. Or, like Fergie says, great start, not really played anybody. That's what people no, say, right? Which I think is unfair. Because well, uh, yeah. <laughs> you end up beating Hearts and teams. I know mm-hmm. Hearts aren't uh-huh. a great start, but. They, they can only beat the teams in front and they've been doing that, they've been playing great football, Aberdeen fans are buying right into it. Look, do I think that it'll be an easy game for Celtic? Not at all. But I just think Celtic are still a, a step. Uh, and and, and the reason I think as well, Daz, uh, because I don't think they keep the ball for uh, long enough, for long mm. periods of time. And if you give no, the ball away against Celtic <laughs> at home, the fans going wave after wave of attack, there's only one. They can, they've got, I think, but enough to catch them on the break. Break, uh, they've got pace. Right, but there you, so that's, so but I just think they'll know that, that, that it's just going to be wave after. So again, how do we see Aberdeen uh, lining up for well, this? They're back four, they've kept the same No, back but I'm four, saying like every game they've kind of took the teams, haven't they, Aberdeen, right, so I, far this season? Will they go to Celtic Park and do the exact same? Or will he be one where he sits in and hits on the counter? I don't know enough about the manager. The same, yeah. it, is, yeah. it is, that's what makes the game so good because but Aberdeen have won all their games, we all know that. And people are now looking at these games are, are always you still look at it and say it's a big game but you would always expect Celtic to win I still expect them to win but I, this is just different and that's what I like about it mm-hmm. could they go there and sit back and try and talk about a bit of pressure and hitting the break is at that the going to have Brendan Rodgers as well Faddy no knowing what this nah, manager how he'll nah, set his team up I think nah, they play, they, they play the same way regardless, regardless it does, they, it does, they, it does they really matter in terms of Celtic's preparation Aberdeen are going to have to defend but the that's just the way the, the game's going to go. They're Aye. going to Celtic Park. They're going to have to defend mm-hmm. and they're going to have to defend well. But I, I'm really interested to see well, yeah, how he goes about it. They'll how, how defend they... in the middle of the <coughs> park as well. That, that midfield, if they're on so Aye. their move, movement. Don't the tactical thing for me, Aberdeen is one thing, right? People can go, oh, well, they go and have a go. Man, Remember, you've got to have this fucking run thing to go and have a go. <laughs> the ball, that, right? And Celtic I'm... dominate yeah, most of the ball, ball at Celtic Park. For me, is where is he going to press? Aye. Right? Is he going to go on the front foot? Because Celtic will play for the back. Yeah. Is he going to press them high? Or is he going to drop off and go on the count? That's the only two <coughs> yeah, things that can be right. It's where he's going to play and how he's going to play. But Celtic will no change because Celtic play the one. If you way. were him, what would you do? Would you press him high up or would you come off a wee bit? I'd come off a wee bit. I think he'll do both yeah. at different times. I think, so. right. uh, I think there are areas where bit. you'll press him high. Aye. And then there's areas where you've got to drop off and make sure they can't. Kind of so say like first goal kick goes down where an Aberdeen. I place. think Aberdeen will be up. Yeah. up against Aye, well, we, we, of course, course go up they're, and, they're and force them to try and kick long if you can. Yeah. Well, they're going to still take it, but I think for restarts like that, they'll, they'll go as high right, as they yeah, can. Them. At times, they're going to need to drop into their shape, force it in an area that they feel they can go and win the ball back. I think the most important thing for Aberdeen is shut the spaces in between your full backs, your sure centre backs, and don't allow space in between your midfield defence. Supposedly in Sweden he was a, a master of sitting in a low block as well. Right, right? Well, there you go. He's, He's not going to be naive enough to come and say, oh, right, we're top of the right. league, we've won every game, beat everybody else, we'll just go and take the game. To watch this game. That'll be a good game. Ah, I'm desperate to see it. That'll be a good game. Um, well, it could it's good that Aberdeen are, but are up there, isn't it? Because I remember years ago when we were playing Aberdeen, mm-hmm. Fergie, you know, the, uh, 
Uh, when fat boy did the count of her. Ah, fuck my dad. You've got about one of best. I've got a one of the best managers. You know what I'd have done? I'd never gave the ball away. Every time I got it, I'd just turn and fucking leather it back to the goalie and he could catch it. You would never give the ball away. 100% passing it. You wouldn't play, mate. You wouldn't play, mate. All he does is keep passing the fucking goalie. You don't try to play ball. See, the fact that goalie... This is thing about progressive. Take the ball, play football. The fact that goalie can pick the ball for a back pass, mate, is... I love the fact that they could just bounce it out. Fucking well, the goalie used to come and cut, and somebody would just knock him into the goal, and it'd be a fucking goal. Ah, uh, that's a good match. You when they, you when they survive in that fit, they'd be oh, fuck it into absolutely oh. fucking no chance. <laughs> 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 they'll be right back to that wee time you get found. We don't only push fuckers <laughs> if we drew Peter Head in the cup. Me and Lee Carr. Amazing. Uh, if Aberdeen do win, uh-huh. do we need to consider him as legitimate? That's, what, that's what I'm saying. Next four games for them you know what I mean they but could be man. you could be sitting here and going Aberdeen of Celtic the Parkade Dundee United Rangers and Celtic in the semi it's a massive four it's, game it, isn't it? it's a brilliant story with Aberdeen the great start but they've been so fortunate as well at times they've carried that wee bit a lot I just think it's time luck, that they're, luck doesn't uh, exist uh, we are up with the green Aberdeen, you know? no because I just uh, listen I, I applaud them because and I, it's it's not that they've uh, they've not played them anybody. Of course they have, and they've they've won, but they've they've had that wee bit of fortune at times in games. I just I know he's like I just think you've just said it. The run of games. This is when it's this but they've, when they've they'll show us what they're games. all about. And they've still had well, some see, Kelly, I said, Mother who are let's flying. Let's see with the end of the week. Mm-hmm. Hearts. So. They've still they've still beat these mm-hmm. these teams. They, like. And maybe the manager is good time to play them, but you still need to beat them. Maybe the manager is a genius. This is what we'll find out. Yeah. I just think it's great that we're actually talking about this game in that sense. We'll see and if they win, is, I hope they challenge us. He has had a wee bit of the game, the fact that it's came at an international week, I think. I really do. Do you? Ah. I'm not in Europe. Where are the boys travelling? Is Maida way to Japan or not? Ah, but fucking hell, come on. I know, he's a he's a machine, but I don't know. I just think it is a wee. A wee favourable one for him. We're early in the season. So well, aye, so. Definitely. Alright. Well, Rogers get fans out of the Devlin was in Croatia, mate. Uh, what, uh, uh, what, uh, <laughs> what other players? <laughs> Aberdeen, they had many away. Uh, I don't know, actually. You go through, I'm, I'm trying sure. to go through the team now, wouldn't I? I thought so. Anyway, we'll see. Uh, Celtic <laughs> travel at Atlanta next week. Uh, can we see a repeat of Dortmund or do you think they'll learn from that? <laughs> Again, it's hard to call. The players will learn. Uh, the players will learn. I don't <clears> know if the, the manager will. Because he's intent on playing his style of football, but I think the players will be a wee bit more savvy about them. I think they'll be a wee bit more cautious. They'll, I know, I know they'll get instructions and they'll be asked to play this way. But as a player, I think, mm, will I go there? No, maybe just we'll go a wee bit, maybe safer option. The players will learn. That's what it is. I don't know about uh, Rogers. I think he was intent on playing the way he wants to. But I, I don't build, think but the, the Dortmund game they tried to just go bang. I, I think they did try and what you've just said about. Getting into a shape to force a press for a deeper position and it didn't work. I don't think the wide men worked hard enough to get back and, and help the, the full backs in the Dortmund game. I think that you, they, they can't they can go again and be open. Mm-hmm. And I'm, I'm not saying that they went with the intention to be open, they can't be that open. They need to narrow up. I think they're a, diff, a different Aye, side. No they a go aggressive, man for man. They're a, they're a very good side. This is going to be probably. I think a, this will be a harder game. I, I think. I, I think it will be. You're all right. I Ooh. think it will be. Atalanta. Physical. No, uh, my, right. my, my fight. My the one you beat them last year. I was one each about three weeks ago. Two, three weeks ago. Wasn't he? Uh, wasn't he uh, the greatest of games? And <laughs> one, should, I, I don't they weren't bad Dortmund. against Arsenal though. Send me Brian in the video that mate. <laughs> that they weren't bad against Arsenal. They beat Bayer Leverkusen. Only team to beat them last season. I think that I think this is a tough game because of their style as well. Yeah. And if, if Celtic go in their open. It'll play in. Would the Bologna do against them? Yeah. So. Would the Bologna do against them? Do you watch it? I think they were 4 3 3. And did they sit off him a bit? A bit. No, they were at home, uh, Bologna, so. Went up against them. Uh, so they, they, they sat in a wee, a wee bit more than Celtic. Yeah. They're not. 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 they are and you're just saying it there about players having to try it back do the hard yards uh, they'll be better they'll not get what about in terms they'll of personnel for this game will you change that obviously put Bernardo on t- you'd expect a tatty to come in wouldn't you? Uh, come uh, back in wouldn't you it'll be interesting what he does in, <coughs> with the weekend with Aberdeen who's got to bring in isn't it? 
But I do agree, I think Hatati will come back in. Or he might stick with... Like, Rodgers is playing the way he's wanting to play, isn't he? So we're all saying, well, is he going to learn? My thing about the full thing is not about... I thought that for the first time this season, when Celtic players got the ball, they sort of uh, were panicking yeah, because yeah. of the, the, yes. the close. So that's, that was my a, question then, Dad. Do you bring in Eden if a team's going to come and do that to you for the chance <clears> to just flip the ball over the top of them and go play for that? I'd rather go a wee bit more direct, direct and then get everybody up. Then go yeah. And get up. Yeah, he could, but it's a hard one to leave Kyogo out, isn't it? Yeah. See, I think, I think Celtic, if they get it right, I think they're tailor made for away from home with the, the, the wide players and Kyogo up front and the pace yes, and everything. Yes. But the problem, Fadi, is quite real, is that they didn't get it right and then they started panicking. Because all of a sudden the goals were getting in quick and we've all been there as players are going, fucking hell, we're, we're, all a, we're all out of place here, what have you got to do? Right, and you start, you start, you know, your, your, your <coughs> feet's working quicker and your brain, you're touching, you're getting the ball away and they're pressing you, they're at home all of a sudden. So they need to be better. Mate, I'm putting death into this as well. I don't think there's a worse feeling in the world when you're playing against in a big stadium and they score douche, douche early doors. Uh, that feeling that comes over you is... Unexplainable. You know, you know, even you look at <laughs> the passing, that you, you're trying your best to play it safe oh, as well, yeah, which is even worse because you just, oh, just play it a wee bit square and safe. And I oh, know. For Do you think experience that's happened going to Ibrox and going to Park Kid where it was with Falkirk, Dunfermline? Many ways you're wrong. I got beat six at Celtic Park. Uh, because oh, I've done six at Ibrox. Yeah, but, and, but because sometimes, as you see other players going, their reaction they're, they're going, either. Oh, f and they don't want the ball. They're like, ah, they don't <laughs> want it. They start going stone on the other side. You try to play a, a bottom and they start stone on the other side so you can't get it. I you used to just You'd rather watch your mum and dad get off each other than, <laughs> aye, aye, than be on that. Aye, 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 I'd walk yeah. in and burst in the bedroom. <laughs> I, I, I started limping. That feeling, man. Uh, it's, war, it's terrible. I, 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 I hate done, that. that oh, I've been there as a manager. What's as a player or a manager, does? Oh, manager, mate. No, oh, I, see I, that, see that day. Really. See that day stone at hand and you're stone away there, right? And you're just, yeah, I was <laughs> dressed quite nice that day. And I'm, you had Ian Cathro's chinos on that mate, day, you bastard. Mate, 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 my full end went away, right? <laughs> I'm looking up at the clock and it's 7 nil after about 78 minutes and I'm thinking, fuck, that's a calendar. That's not even a clock, that's a calendar. <laughs> yeah. uh, was yeah, all we played air the start of the season, right? First 35 minutes, I'm like, we're actually doing all right here. I think we're one, one, uh, two down maybe at the time, but we, mm. we're doing well. Six minutes later, we were 5 0 down. Bonkers, aren't it? Just complete, they scored to make it three, and then we just completely went oh. at half time. You're sitting 5 0 down. Yeah. Mick was in the stand that day, the loneliest <laughs> place in the world, man. At home? <laughs> no, Airdrie. And I was getting that boost from Airdrie. Did you get there? Keep going, boys. Keep going, boys. Lift it, lift it. What about an Airdrie fan Saturday? Obviously, I mentioned Steph on this quite a bit. Standing on the side of the pitch, and an Airdrie fan goes, ah. Where's Steph? She's coming to my house tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's a brilliant shout, isn't it? <laughs> no, <laughs> she's, no, she's at Dazzlers. <laughs> <laughs> my two boys in the stand, they came at me, went, I have to, went, somebody's shouting about Mum yeah. <laughs> See, that's the worst, isn't it? With the boys. Very tall, mate. Oh, you think that's what? Nah. Oh, very tall, man. That's going to be a very grand I got night? on now. The chip shop. He's got a lot shout out here. Ah, Quintalian, he's a lot cool. Yeah, because you got that free as hell, I think. <laughs> and we started talking, he's like, I ah, enjoy the boys open goal and all that. And he went, How's Carol? <laughs> he's never met her. <laughs> fucking boys in them, what? Well, do you start getting paranoid? Like, How do you know Carol? Carol? I didn't know her, man. How the fuck do you know her? Got a, got a sausage supper for a no, I get two, I get two, for her. I get two, <laughs> she likes two sausages. Tell her jumbo. I get two pickles on the house. There you go. That's what I did. What, did you, what was your order? Uh, oh, it was just a fish supper and a sausage supper. I'm my, my granddaughter, uh, who's Ooh. back from Italy. Uh, don't oh, she don't say in. She never had Greg's it, did lunch she? yesterday. She had Greg's <laughs> and then she had a chippy last night. Ah. Oh, Lucy will be raging. I you. know, because they feed her all healthy stuff and all that. It's welcome to Ireland. Uh, that's what happens when you go to your Scotland. granny and granddad. What would you say for dinner? We're going to go to Rangers now, but what would you say for dinner <laughs> last night? The chip, hey, by the way, what a fun shop. Terry Mendes. Zima. Where's that? Oh, the Chinese place. Nice. Where was that? Sorry. I wouldn't have got it. Right. <coughs> no, in the tune. In the tune. You're not going to believe what I had for dinner on last night. What? I had mashed potatoes with plenty of butter, corned beef and beans. Corned oh, beef? You're a psychopath. Mate, how nice is that? What, corned beef just out of a pack? Aye. 
what are you doing, Barry? Writing a letter. Who to Barry? I wonder what you're fucking talking about. That. <laughs> What's it say, Barry? Give me HP beans. <laughs> or I'll run away from home. Are you really going to do Barry? <laughs> of course. I HP. I, I don't like it. You're an incredible I, actor, Barry. What's that? What's that? The beans are there. Aye. I don't know. Know. Like, how did you name your brother? You would have been like Because nine I five. remember I was playing down the park at Balanock and my granny shouted there, my granny Fergie, You've got a wee brother! It was like magic, and then I started thinking, what am I going to, I, I knew I was going to be able to name him. And I went, I'll name him after that Beans advert. And they're like, that, like, it's not the five Beans advert. You're all right. That's the last, it's not his bluff, it's not his bluff, it's not his That was just before the toy and the, the Barry L started battling. Would he, uh, was he great, would he cry all the time, Barry? Huh? Oh, I'm more than that, I'm more than that. Soon as I, honestly. Are you great at it though, didn't you? No. no. He's just great. You <laughs> need to name your wee brother. Year, isn't he? Anyway. He's great for 45 years. He's a stun. What a guy. Uh, right, a big weekend for Rangers away at Rugby Park. Obviously, Club outside have picked up. But this will be their toughest fixture to, for a while now, nah? I'll have been doing well, but... Uh, but why, why, why do you but, say it's the toughest fixture? Uh, it's it's, it's interesting, isn't it? Because of the pitch? Uh, the pitch. The pitch, I don't the weather. I've looked there. at the weather forecast as well. I don't think it's going to be too too good. It's because Derry McInnes, the good, we all know that, good yeah. manager who set them up, be hard to break down. Uh, but I think Rangers should look forward to that, I don't know. Yeah. And I, again, it's 12 o'clock. Only game, well, Scottish Premier game on that day, big game. Boy, that's the way, it's, it's different the way you look at it. Uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to it, I'm looking for a good performance for Rangers. I uh, get a few of them, we're just talking about Suter. He's in good form at the minute. Uh, Bajrami, he's playing well. Yeah. He's Suter gets a call up into the, uh, the National City. Barron, sorry. Ah, so, no. Barron, sorry. Yeah. What did I say there? Suter again. Suter big again, Suter I love big, uh, big soapy oh, Suter, different gravy. I've never heard Suter's <laughs> name <laughs> <laughs> so much. I'm Suter, aye. <laughs> what about Shelley Aberdeen game? I see Suter was <laughs> playing. No, I'm telling you now. I want you to ask you to, what, so what's Rangers best 11 for this game? Oh, I tell Just you what. Ken Suter's my goalie. Suter's granny. Suter's granny at the centre back. He'll go with the same back four. He'll play Tav. Again, he'll play Suter proper. Uh, Yefty, uh, he'll be Baron in the middle of the park. Uh, Diamandi, Lots. and then he'll go. But well, he's, he's been struggling with an in right. injury. So whether he brings uh, Bajrami in, you know, brings McCausland in the wide area. Uh, Maybe a case of Cherny, going Cherny, Cherny and Des or something. No, no, no. Did, you'll not do that. He's not going to. If you're but going to do that, you'll play. D- maybe Egamami 10, no? remember Dundee United he came on? No, played. he'll not play him. He's no. No, he's yeah. going to play him as a, an out and out centre forward. Uh, I'd like to see maybe Bajrami come in, one. But then again, he's got good oh, legs now. Uh, so he has. He's quick, he's good isn't he? He's good at coming in. Who's going to play in the 10 role? Like? I know that's. Uh, <coughs> Diamond has played in the past. I tell you who. Maybe put a Sterling in the middle of the pitch. Could he do that? He, he could, uh, or else will he uh, even go right back? Will he? Ka- Kaj- uh. Kajviro, is that how you spell his uh, name? And put Tav <laughs> further up. I don't know. He done that in St John's in the second half. I don't think he will, mm. but uh, but it's interesting to see who will be the, the ten. Uh, aye, well he's played. He's brought him in there, isn't he? So, uh, but Hadji, but Hadji suspended. He would have been uh, one you would have looked at. So. Uh, it'll be interesting to see who is, who is in that 10 role but it's a game we look forward to so it is uh, they're still searching for a bit of confidence Kelly as well aren't they yeah. uh, so good game one to look forward to I think ah, but not the home win have they game. Kelly no, so and don't get me wrong they got a good one up at Dundee uh, right. was it thanks to the fact that it gave them a wee bit of advantage to mm. 10 men a bit all, all <coughs> credit to Aye. they come back and they got a good so that might kick start their season but you talk about good times. If I was Rangers, I wouldn't be too frightened to go into rugby park. Mm. Right. I'm going to give you one. Could you? And I don't think they will. Would you play Barron in there? Because he, he did that in the second half against St Johnson. Raskin could come in there and sit in but there with, with Diamandi and put me back. Barron can play further up. He's clever I, I enough. Would, up there, he's not going to do it because he spoke mm. about dropping or trying to get Raskin to play a different uh, position. Uh, if you were going to pick one of the three, I'd put Raskin uh, further forward. 
It's just got me thinking when you're saying <coughs> that, who's playing that number I 10? I think you're asking, but he seems yeah. to be... Uh, they've they played a wee bit more recently, Rangers, haven't yeah. they? Will that Aye. change again because maybe the Astro will they go maybe more, more direct to Dester's? I, I think Kelly. you're more suited to going and playing a wee I, bit I more. I think if, if they go and more direct, it'll suit Kelly more. Aye. Than yeah. Rangers. I think you'll go to play a wee bit. I think, uh, mm. you, look, I know that, <coughs> that it's not a great surface, but you can still play football on it. You can still, you know, have the intent to play. You, you, you need to, to go... When you go long, it's because you're either beating a press or trying to exploit space. If you just go long for the start, mm. right. it's, it suits Kelly. They're, they're big, you, big you know, they're, they're aggressive, they're quick. Yeah. For even they can they can squeeze the pitch. They're, they're they're quick at going in behind as well. I just think you you play into Kelly's hands. Kelly have had a a good win just before the international break. He'll be hoping he can get you know his full squad back fit. And I think these are the type of games, I know you're saying it's a good time, or you would be looking forward to it, you should look forward to every game, but of course, these are the types of games that Kelly seem to do well in, and because you, you know you can frustrate, you know you can defend your box, you can defend crosses, they've got a great option to hit in the, the counter as well, I, or be aggressive if they want to, if they want to be, I think it'll be a tough game, but I, I think another, another good game for, for the weekend. Because we're only there a bet builder at the end, I'm just going to ask you what you, your, your <coughs> thoughts are on the result of this. Kelly Rangers, who do you fancy? Rangers? I fancy Rangers, yeah. I do. I fancy Rangers as well, but uh, I just think I've got a funny feeling it's just going to be a good game. No, a good game. Draw the Yanks, bad, yeah, huh? I think, I think uh, Rangers need to win. So, the put that, it's, that's just tough. It's a game you get back to that <coughs> mentality, mindset. But that's it, you just go and win a game of football. Aye. Aye. What about Hearts and Man? Who do you fancy for that, for the new manager? I think the new manager bounce there. You go. I think yeah. it'll be. Uh -huh. ah, I yeah. think it'll be difficult. If, but you always have this new manager bounce, and the players mm -hmm. seem yeah, to yeah. find that yeah. way. Saint Mirren have not really hit the heights either. Yeah. Yeah. But, but, but Saint Mirren are well organised and they've got good players, <laughs> and he does a great job there. But I just think new manager sitting there, everybody, you know what, like is want to impress and wee bit extra. They're mm. at home. They get the derby the following week. They've played. They've played well last couple of games. Didn't they? Oh, yeah. Sorry, they've played better Under the last couple of games. So yeah. I would, I would go for Hearts. Hearts as well, Derek. I'm going to go with uh, Dundee United Hibs. What are you thinking? I fancy oh. Dundee United. Hibs need there, a win, don't they? Hibs need. I know, but needing a win and getting one is completely. Ah, uh, I think Hibs will get a win. Do you? Do you? Well, based that on could what? Be a draw. Right. Don't know. Just a, just a, a wee. Hunch. Just I, I just think. I just think Dundee United have started they great have, at home. They have, confidence. Huh? I'm go, I'll, go, I'll go for the tangerines. Alright. I'd need the edge towards that as well. Right, right. okay. And then uh, Motherwell Dundee? Oh, Motherwell long. Flying, huh? <laughs> Never in doubt. Flying Although, either. tipped them for a draw last week and they won, so I'll go for... A draw again? Motherwell win. <laughs> Uh, and then St Johnson North County. <coughs> oh, no, abandoned. Named the case. Who's, <laughs> who's brave enough to go watch that? Abandoned. St Johnson. They get a new manager. Uh, so, listen. Oh, he why. was brave before the. Uh, He's another man who came break. for a minute. I know he came for Val Valacari. Uh, four yeah. strikers. Did you know Ken Valacari? No, I don't he, care. I'm I'm I have a bit of fun. I have a It's just a laugh. I wish him all the best, especially we Lee, if you're watching Lee. Lee Cass. No, don't worry. St Johnson North County, who are you thinking? Uh, I'm going to go with it. Aye, St John's. I don't even think you'll need a ball for that game. I'd just fucking. No, just let them run into each other. I would just toss. St John's will try and play. <laughs> play shadow. <laughs> try and play a wee bit. So the ball, uh, St John's. I'll go. I'll, I think a draw. I think Cowie will go down there and get a wee draw. I think that's. Paddy? Cool. I, I'm leaning towards a draw. A draw. All right. Right. We're going for the Coupon, the set of the Aberdeen Bet Builder. Uh, goals. Over or under how many he's want to go? We'll go over, innit? Because we're aye. Is aye. A pessimist? Under, is that right? under ten. Over three. Under what? ten. <laughs> <laughs> over three. Th over three over goals. Over three. Yes, aye. I'd, I'd go over three point five goals. Aye. Over. You think so? Yeah, there'll be four goals in this game. Yes, definitely. Aye. <coughs> I did. Three goals in this mate. Fuck. Yeah, that's fine. I've no. <laughs> I'll, I'll leave it to you, free. You are the fucking. You are kidding yourself. Right on you. I'm who's gone me over three, but you. I'll let you. Over three point five. I'll go over three point five. Aye, right, aye, aye. I do think there's goals in this. Did I'm going over 2.5. Uh, well, three goals in this. We're, we're all going together though. Right, we're going. Over we're three all and a half. All together. Oh, Let's go for it. Why don't we get into the <coughs> computer? Fuck already, man. I mean, what does the computer say? What does the computer say? No. <laughs> uh, <laughs> both teams to score, yes or no? Well, you oh, better yes. say yes, because we're I'm going for four goals. No, I, that's that's what what you think Celtic are going to win four nil against an informed Aberdeen? Everybody's going. Oh, it's great aye. to talk about. Aye. Listen, listen. Nick Carter Vickers, it's 
trust it. I'm not I'd trust go, it. I'm go not yes. sure. I'd go but yes. I, I think Aberdeen will score. Is Taylor fit? He was out of there. No, I don't think so. Uh-huh. I, I, know, I think Aberdeen will score. Right, okay, we'll go with that. What, do you not know, like the others? Oh, he's buying. No, I do, but I think he's as good defensively as Taylor. I think he's very good on the ball, but I think he's good, good defensively as what Taylor is. Right, Aberdeen to score then? Yeah, I'd go Aberdeen to score. I'm not so sure. <laughs> What's the computer say? He, 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 he said, I think he's got to be 3 now. Uh, so he's went for four, over 3 four, goals and no other didn't score. I think I'm at 4 now. What's the computer I, say? I think, I think it could be about 4 or 5, not honestly. So both teams have got. 4 or 5 now? <laughs> <laughs> what is it with you, man? Them dog not moved to Lewis Kills. Oh, oh, no. He's doing well, mate. Just get oh, over it. Hey. It's worked to the best for yeah, him. Yeah, I'll go. What do you want to go? Yes or no? Aberdeen to score, I'm going no. Daddy? So you think it's going to be 4 0 then? No, I'm going to go, go on that. Two for fuck I think Chelsea will win 2 or 3 0. Do you want to take it doing over 2.5 goals then? Yeah, I think. I see nothing. Two and a half. Two and a half. I think they don't think Aberdeen are going to score, so I'm. Do you think they're going to score? I think they. I think they will. Right, we'll give them a goal. Right, four man. Fuck it. Over three and a half. Both teams. By the way, I'm terrible at this. No, I. So I know. So we are. We have been murdered by the way. I don't think we need. Right, I think we can play the other one safe now because I think that's that. That one's a bit decent. So we actually need to get corners. Over how many corners? Oh, over six corners. Oh, it's going to be well over that. Eight over it. Ten. Over eight corners. Uh, name that tune. <laughs> Remember that one? <laughs> Over nine point five. Over nine point five. Oh, what? I know who he's going to say for scorer. Suter. Aye, uh, John Suter. Any <laughs> 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 Anytime scorer, who you want to go for? Okay, uh, uh, Mike Maida. Oh, uh, has been. I'm, I'm going Ingles. I tell you what, I'm going. Uh, Penalty. Maida goes. <laughs> we all need to agree. No, Maida, Ingles, Ingles, fucking hell. Ingles, penalty. You always go with a penalty uh, at home. I, well, he played. Jenkins will play. Uh, so, because he wasn't even a bit of a shocker. Oh. Struggled at the county, didn't he? Ah, he'll, he'll, he'll play. He'll play. He'll play. Uh, 11 million he's got. He'll play every fucking minute, won't he? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> he's got to justify it. Are you going? Right, who are we going here? Fuck's sake. <laughs> no, that's, that's his longer than the podcast. I've got stuff to do. <laughs> oh. Right, Ken. fine. Go on. We'll go with your. Ken! He's. he's I cut it. Cool. Yeah, I could see him cut. I could cut. And their fullback's going high. Yeah, I'm telling you now. Can I? Fullbacks are good. I don't want any. We should start getting there in single ones. I Engels. want my in bet. But who you want to go there? I'll go with Engels. Right. Engels. That'll get the money up. Uh, and Man, lastly, full time result: Celtic draw or Aberdeen. Celtic. 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 All day. What does that pay? A million. Goodbye, fucking shirt. You stick fifty quid on that. What'd you get back? Nothing, because it's not going to come up. <laughs> what is it? 19 to 2? 19 to 2, 2 and 19. Too much, thing. Oh, that's 3, what's yeah, happening? Do you get stamp duty on that? 450. 500, 450. Yeah, 500. Stamp duty on that. Stamp duty on that, yeah. yeah. Boys, it's a bit. Oh, that was a bit.